Hasidic thought for the day. In this week's Parsha, Parsha's Tetzava, we learn about the appointment of the Kohanim, or to be Kohanim, making Aaron and his children as the priests. And the Torah uses an interesting term, it calls it filling, filling them with this appointment. Umileisa yad Aaron, you will fill the hand of Aaron, the yad banav, and the hand of his children. Also the actual making of the Mishkan from an ordinary building to become a holy structure, also went through a process which is called miluyim, shivas yemei hamiluyim, the seven days of filling, which is a strange term. Why filling? What is the meaning of filling? So the great and saintly Rabbi Levi Yitzhak of Bardichev teaches a phenomenal teaching that we're always thirsting, we always want to achieve, we want to reach, we want to amass, we want to um, gain more of whatever it is, and we have this idea that when I will finally have that house, when I will finally take that vacation, when I will finally uh, reach and find that person in my life, uh, that will make me a whole human being and that will bring me fulfillment. And constantly we're chasing and chasing and chasing and we all find out that no matter it is what we lay our hands on and what we achieve and what we attain, there is always something lacking. We don't ever have that fulfillment. The sages tell us that if you have 100, you want 200, and if you have 200, you want 400, and the human soul is always thirsty. Um, the reason for that is because everything in this world is inherently finite and therefore lacking. So no matter how comfortable you are, there's possible for more comfort and there's possible for something else uh, that you don't have. And since everything in this world is lacking, so even if you have what we might think as everything, like all the money in the world, you are still lacking because the whole world is lacking. The only way that one can achieve fulfillment is to attach his or herself to a being who is perfect and not lacking anything. The moment God pervades your space, that brings a true sense of fulfillment to a human being. Because here you're connecting to that which is essentially fulfilled, that which is essentially wholesome. Now that doesn't mean that connecting to Hashem is a one-time achievement. One continuously grows, and as King David says, Tzamalach Anafshi, my soul is thirsting for you for more and for more and for more. But that is in addition to the powerful and deep, true fulfillment that comes from that connection. And that is the reason why the Torah refers to this making uh, appointment, the appointment of Aaron as fulfillment, because the being a Kohen means to be a servant of God, which means attachment to Hashem. And then you are in Milesa, then you're filled. Your hands are filled. The Mishkan is also filled with the presence of God because the Mishkan is the only place for true fulfillment.